Okay, now let's take a look at the beginning or typical exercise program for strength. Three set to ten is probably the most popular. And then you can find five by five, five three one, four by four, whatever you can, whatever you name, you're gonna find it out there. But are these the best programs, especially to start with? I'm sure all of you, if you ever started with three sets to ten, you were sore as heck the next day. And then you're in agony for a whole bunch of days. There's a much better way to start and good rationale for it. And we're going to start with a 20 rep routine. And you may say 20 reps, oh no, that's all endurance. No, it is an endurance. You're going to get both endurance and strength. And you're going to get the same amount of strength, if not more, by doing a routine like this for a while. And this is not just me talking, it can be proven. We can show you all kinds of results from football teams that have used this and the results that they've gotten, as well as other teams. So when you do the 20 rep routine, and this is 20 maximum reps. The first five, 10 reps, therefore endurance, maybe up to 15. But then you get into the latter repetitions, the intensity is just as great as when you're handling a maximum set of, let's say, three maximum repetitions. So you're getting the intensity at the end, endurance at the beginning. So you're getting both endurance and strength. And you need both. You need the endurance for recovery. You can't just start off with strength all by itself. You're never going to be successful. Now let's take a look at how this program is going to look when you're doing 20 maximum reps. Okay, now Joe's going to do our 20 maximum rep routine. He hasn't done it before, so I'll be interested to see how he reacts. Okay, Joe, whenever you're ready. And he can just count it out to himself. We're not going to have to count. See, make sure you got good form. Keep the arch in your lower back. Arch in the low back has to stay all the time. Now notice how even here, starting at the beginning, it's pretty tough. Even though he's only doing about five or six, seven reps, it's still taxing him, even though we're working on mainly endurance. So you can see it's starting to get a little tougher for him. So don't always just think endurance. These are not easy by any means. We, even though it's lighter intensity than a heavy intensity routine, he still has ample intensity, and that's what we're looking for. These has to even pause a little bit. Starting to get to him. Okay, now I, this was an example of one exercise done for 20 maximum reps. Now, Joe, what did you think about it? It definitely felt a lot different than what I'm used to. I don't normally do the, the three sets of 10, but uh, even just going from 15 to 20, I could feel the change in intensity with every rep. Yeah, and this is what you're gonna feel also. Now, it's radical, it's different. You've probably never heard it before and you think, oh, 20, 20 reps, yeah, that's easy, that's nothing to it. But believe me, try it and you're gonna see the difference. And this is really for beginners, first getting started. This is not for somebody who's been lifting weights for 10 years and uses maximum weights. This is for somebody getting started, or even somebody who's been on a program for a couple years. Especially valuable for high school kids. This is what they should be doing. Lower intensity, but still maximum intensity for their bodies. So we're gonna get the benefits from it. So you have to be open-minded, think of it, try it. You're gonna see the results, guaranteed. No problem there. So, good luck on that program.